Hey everyone, Patricia here. I'm afraid that I have some very bad news for anybody who is planning on seeing my panels over at Florida Supercon. Well, let me just tell you what happened. Uh, a few days ago, I posted to everyone saying that uh, the old school lane Q&A was going to be on Sunday at 11 a.m. and it was going to be in this room, and everything was going great. But then a few days later, I received confirmation of my second panel, the Classic Nickelodeon Jeopardy panel, and that was going to be at 10.45 a.m. at a completely different room. And so I called the people who were running the panel saying, um, I'm sorry, there is absolutely no way that I can be able to be at two different places at once. I mean, I know I'm going to an anime, uh, comic book, video game convention, but uh, I don't think you guys have clone machines. And so... They tried their very best to work out with whatever, uh, you know, rooms that they can put me in at the last minute, and unfortunately, they couldn't do anything about it, so both of my panels ended up being cancelled. Yeah, that really sucked. Especially since I put down in advance, like around March, that I wanted to go do a panel over at Florida Supercon. I was going to do my very first panel, and then it just went out of out of control when the people who were in charge of doing my panels pretty much screwed it up. So yeah, for anybody who was planning on coming all the way down to Miami to see me do a panel, then I'm sorry. I I feel just as bad about, you know, me not doing it as much as you not participating in it, so yeah. But the good news is, is that they were able to give me a um, four-day free pass uh, in, in, in order for them to make up for them screwing up my schedule. So, yeah, I will be at Florida Supercon for all four days. Well, maybe not Friday because I won't be able to be there on that day because, you know, finishing up with work. But... I am planning on being there for Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. So, if you do happen to be around Florida Supercon, then please come by and say hi. I'll be hanging out with um, possibly my cousins. We're going to be going around all of the uh, the rooms and just meeting up with some of the people who are going to be over there. It's, uh, I'm, you know, and maybe I'll get some more time to actually record, um, you know, my footage of being at Florida Supercon and... Yeah, I'm going to try to see if I can make it the best way that I can. I'm trying to, you know, look at the positive side against this big negative thing that just recently happened to me. Anyway, but um, now, um, speaking of that, um, yeah, what am I going to do with uh, this? The, uh, the books and, uh, let's see if I can find it, oh yeah, and the, uh, the DVDs. So, what am I going to do with this? I mean, since I don't have the panels anymore, I still have the four copies of Slimed and Oral History of Nickelodeon's Golden Age, and I still have four different DVDs of Nickelodeon shows. You know what? I'm going to save them for now. Uh, maybe when Old School Lane hits a milestone mark, similar to what I did the 500 subscriber Q&A, maybe I'll do a 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Who knows? Uh, maybe that'll be a lot of fun. Maybe, yeah, that, that's probably what I'll do. When I hit 1,000 subscribers on the Old School Lane YouTube channel, maybe I'll give these away as prizes, uh, you know, for any of my followers who have been supportive throughout this whole time. Or maybe if you came by recently, I don't know. So yeah, um, bottom line, yeah, I'm sorry. I mean, I worked really, really hard on, you know, doing the Jeopardy questions. I, I, I took like two weeks to work on this, and you probably noticed that I haven't been doing a lot of con, uh, um, content. I'm sorry. I've just been working super hard. I was going to do possibly a video that I was supposed to release, uh, like maybe momentarily during the old school lane Q&A of, of um, a video, possibly either the from Pilot to Final Product on, on Invader Zim or Heroic Gem or Junk, the very first episode, and I was going to present it to everybody even before uploading on YouTube, but yeah, that seems like it's not going to happen. I, I will still upload them, though. Don't, don't you worry. Uh, it'll be done in due time. So now I just need to focus on the next things, you know? And as mentioned before on... Um, Facebook and Twitter, I am planning on, hopefully, fingers crossed, doing three or four more themed months this the rest of the year. 
And, uh, yeah, uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. Thank you guys so much for being so supportive, and I'm very sorry about not doing the panels. Um, it just was a mix-up that cannot be undone. I know some of you guys may be feeling really disappointed, but imagine how I'm feeling. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm going to go I'm going to get going. Uh, I have I still have a lot of stuff to do. Uh if you haven't checked it out, I recently did a podcast uh with Jim and Kyle from Manic Expression as well as the founder of the Real Open Nickelodeon Studios page, Zach. We talked about good and bad reboots, remakes and revivals. It was it's almost 2 hours long. It's it's uh became like one of my favorites, so Please uh, check it out, and um, in a couple of days, uh, my good buddy Tom from Comic Book Cast and I are going to be doing a discussion about the legacy of Sonic the Hedgehog, because this coming week is going to be the 25th anniversary, so yeah, a lot of cool stuff coming, so I uh, hope to see you guys around soon. Take care.